<laughs> so it's me, your little boy, okay, so I'm saying. So I have something special for us today. You know, they are what they are no longer what in love with you. Because God is not after what they are saying about you. <laughs> Let me tell you, they have finally discovered that God is not after what they are saying. God is really after what he has said about you. <laughs> hey, you know, the truth is this. They will never love you again. Because they have finally come to realize that all things work kept perfectly to them that are in Christ. Hey, yeah. that is why you need to understand that majority of people around you, many of them have been offended. <laughs> majority of people around you, many and multitudes of them are what have already been what be offended. You have hurt a lot of people. You have automatically hurt them mentally, <laughs> academically, in all ratification. You have hurt them, believe me, because they have finally come to realize that all that they are thinking that is going to break you is what God is accurately using to promote you. <laughs> so it's really pissing them off, bro. It's really, really pissing majority of people out there off. And it's hurting them because they have finally come to realize that, ah, the thing that they thought is going to kill you have now become something that, that grow to the point of, what, of, of multiplying you, promoting you, and extending you to your greatness. So that is why majority of people have their choosings. That is why many of them are unhappy. That is why many of them are filled with frustration. That is why many of them are filled with pain. That is why many of them are filled with sadness. Because God has automatically put an end to their, to their evil expectation. So what they thought will destroy you, the way they thought you are going to end, is not the way they are seeing. <laughs> so there are a lot of people who have been thinking that you are going to end as a failure. There are a lot of people who are thinking that you are going to end and regretting why you leave them. There are a lot of people who are thinking that the moment they leave your life, the moment they walk away, that will mark the beginning of your, of your, of a failure. That will mark the beginning of you failing. That will mark the beginning of you what, lacking progress, lacking sources. That will mark the beginning of you growing. So many of them now are, now are not seeing what they expect to see. Many of them now are, 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 are like, what is going on? Why God keep disappointing them? <laughs> so believe me, it hurt them because all that they met for evil have become something that God has finally used to do or to run the stone around. What they thought is going to terminate your email, what they thought is going to terminate your, your name, the way they thought they are going to spoil everything, they have finally come to realize that God is not indeed after what they are saying. God is not after the evil they planted in your life. God is not after the setup. God is not after the evil they did. God is not after what the gossip. God is not after the malice. God is not after the hate. <laughs> God is not after all that they have in mind. And that is why many of them are unhappy with you. That is why majority of them are pissed off. Because some of them are like, why is it that God is not after what they are saying? Why is it that God is not after what they are talking? Why is it that God is not listening to them? Why it looks like the more they plan evil, the more God disappoints them. <laughs> because some of them want you to end the way they want, and we want you to be a failure because we are failure <laughs> we want you to fail because we failed how can you be succeeding we are not how can you be progressing we are not how can you be doing <laughs> but God tell them God is saying to them no <laughs> right from the cross <laughs> my son have already made it all and he said, it is finished. So affliction <laughs> have no place in us. <laughs> Failure 
is part of our greatness. <laughs> and you, you know, the gossiping is part of our stepping stone. <laughs> Jealousy is part of our jumping stone. So it's really, really pissing them off. Because everything that they are doing to stop you is something God is using to elevate you. So God is not indeed after what they are saying about you. God is not after the evil they did. And that's why many of them are unhappy. That's why many of them are, are, what, are scared. That's why they are terrified. Because they never believe that despite of all their evil, you will still be progressing. <laughs> That's how I always tell us. If God perventure, open your eyes with article. I mean, I, I'm not saying a, a minute or two minutes, three article of hour to see some kind, some kind of friend, some kind of people you call your friend. The evil that they are planning, the way they arrange it, the evil that they are setting. My brother, you will prefer to be living alone. <laughs> so it hurts majority of people because God is not indeed after what they are saying about you. Remember, blessed may God bless you.